He's big, he's lazy, he's one of the worst Pokemon ever conceived. It's lacking. Ladies and gents, the Pokemon that has legendary stats, but is still always ending up in the lowest tiers because of his ability, it's slacking. Obviously you guys know and love this thing. Oh, fun fact, I relied on this thing quite a lot in my playthrough of Pokemon Ruby originally. It's good, you know, even though it's obviously very gimped with its ability, I think it's a lot of fun. So I have been asked a couple of times by different people to use this thing, so I thought, you know, I, I'm a man of the people, I can do that. Got a nice choice banded double-edged slacking. Now Giga Impact did sound fun, but I think it's just inviting setup, so maybe not the best idea. So we've got Double Edge, Earthquake, Knockoff is new, and that's actually a huge buff for this thing. So you can just hit something really hard, obviously gives you the coverage for ghost types like Haunter, and you can just get rid of items. And the Facade, because I think the chance of you taking a status effect is quite high with this thing. I mean, it's also pretty bulky, so you can use it to switch into a lot of stuff, so I think Facade is quite nice. And what better Pokemon to go with Choice Band Knockoff than Choice Band Poltergeist? Got a nice little Spirit Team here just for some priority and crippling stuff. I think Choice Band a Trick is amazing, just for stopping setup. So we got Sneak, Poltergeist, and Foul Play. It's pretty normal Spirit Tomb, I think. Nothing too fancy. With the defensive Orthworm for the spikes. Nice little brown Raichu for the Volt Switching. Nice little Terra Fairy there, just in case we need it for stuff like Diplin. We have Big Lenny there, just for the... Oh, excuse me, I forgot your name. Big Lenny. Just for the Rapid Spin. And Sludge Bomb, of course, is amazing. Coverage there for the Grass Types. And then finally, our team was a little bit fire weak, so I thought, eh, we can sort of alleviate that with a Houndoom. So, nice little flash fire Houndoom. Nasty plot. And also Sucker Punch, because that comes in handy sometimes. If you guys enjoy this one, don't forget to smash that like, and let's get on with the games. Okay, so we're playing the ZU tier today, which is the tier below PU. And ZU is very, very dead, so we need more people playing it. I'd like it if Smogon made this an official tier, and I've reached out to a couple of people, but no responses yet. So if you guys can just throw messages at anyone you know on Twitter or, or whatever, just say, make ZU official. This looks like Trick Room, kind of. I'll go with the... Go with the nice Orthworm lead. It's actually crazy that Glastria is down here. That thing's good in PU and NU, to be honest. Especially on a Trick Room team. So we got Orthworm. Yeah, this thing could have flamethrower, we've got to be a little bit careful. Let's see what he has. Alright, right for the trick room, okay. So let's try going to Houndoom first. Yep, yeah, looks good. I mean, would he kill us? I mean, he might. If he's Life Orb, I think he kills us. Let's just suck punch this thing. Oh, and also, if you guys enjoy this one, don't forget to smash that like. That'd be much appreciated. Here comes Gerda. Not something I'll deal with that well, to be honest. We'll go Spirit Team. So he knocks off. Yep, and now we can just do this just to, to cripple something. Yoink that item back. Alright, we got a Guave Berry. Understandable. So go for a nice little foul play. Hey, that's kind of nice. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I mean, why he has Trick on a Guave Berry for a graph, I don't know. I couldn't tell you. But I'm just going to Trick again. <laughs> We got, what are we doing here, man? What's the plan? Trick again. <laughs> Stop it. And there's the alchemy. So that's absolutely fine. 
I actually don't know how much Poltergeist would do to this. Should we find out? Because he just absolutely wrecks us. Okay. So we're going to go to Bandit Slacking now, of course. Go for a nice little double edge. You know, that looks suspiciously like Choice Bucks Alchemy. So we get rid of that, that's beautiful. In comes the dumbass giraffe, let's go Orthworm. Yep, cool. Spike. It's gonna steal my lefties, which is annoying, but not the end of the world. I will just... Body press. Bit of chip on the girder. That's alright. Now these do tend to have defog, so let's... Eh. I'll just body press, whatever. Pretty big hit. This is a Pokemon we deal with very, very badly, I should add. Just gonna heavy slam. That's all right, bit of chip. I'm just gonna bop it with a nice and powerful double edge. And now we could have mug punch. Let's go right you. And I think Terror Blast is quite good here. Yep, that looks good. Get rid of you. So there'll be no more trick rooming here. Now something's going to get absolutely wrecked by an ice school crash. I mean, I could try Scooby Doom. See if it takes one. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, that's good. That puts Glass in range of anything. Back to this thing. Eh, Terror Blast is looking good. Pseudo Wudo. Slacking's dead weight at this point. So I can quite happily go to Big Lenny. Yeah, just Earth Power. I don't think he actually terrored, did he? No. I wonder what he's saving it for. Ow. Jesus Christ, this thing is strong. Alright, there's the big girder. Earth Power U, as he turns into a poison type. Beautiful. Chef's Kiss. Could not have gone better. I'll go next. Ah, yes. The 1000v1000 Smurf account war. Let's go. Alright. <laughs> Who knows what rating you're going to face. On this ladder. Assuming a whiskash lead question mark. I think Toad School was very good. I think we gotta leave with the big guy to be honest. The big Chungus. Let's go with... Oh, this thing's actually kind of scary. I'll knock off. Let's get rid of your Eevee light. Bulk up. Okay. I understand. 
We'll go Spirit Tomb. We do have Choice Bind to Foul Play, of course. Which is beautiful. Just play rough, god damn it. Well then. I'll go Houndoom. Go for a nice little Fire Blast. Yeah, I wasn't expecting Fairy, but I guess that works. Let's pick him off with the Dark Pulse. I'm actually just surprised he took that. He must have a lot of Spadef investment. Definitely want to be getting those spikes up to wear down the Magneton if it's like scarfing. Vault switching around, you know. Hard Toad Scroll. Alright, goes Haunter, which is not a huge deal. Got some good chip on that. Hmm. I'm just going to Gig Drain again, because I want to scout his item. As he tricks. Interesting. Okay. Now we go slacking. Lorantis, okay. Right. Let's see if we can take this thing out in one hit. <laughs> it goes Haunter. Re. Back to Lenny. That's okay. Take a Sludge Wave. Not a problem. Sludge Bomb on the Haunter. Good chip. Do it again. I mean, he might go to Magnets. I don't know, man. Seems like a damn 50 50 to me. Maybe slacking here. Do Destiny Bonds, okay. Back to Lenny. Now we can do this. I think we just go for a surf. Well, that's kind of kind of fat, isn't it? Let's try this. Let's slurp that up, and I think we can get some spikes up. What are we with Terra Ghost? I think so that kind of works out for us. Right, I'm going to protect, see if he goes for D-Bond here. Which would work out for us. Just Shadow Balls, okay. Fuck it, Heavy Slam. As he goes to Magnets, that's cool. Yeah, looks good, protect. And now we can Body Press this thing. Jesus. Things too strong. Looks like a Specs Magneton if I've ever seen one. So what we can do now is go to Scooby Doom and just Dark Pulse. Get rid of you. That's nice. Right, this big boots chungus comes in. I'm going to. I'm going to pray that we take an earthquake. Oh, no, it's earth power, isn't it? I forgot. Because we're minus defense nature, basically, is is what I was getting at. But this might be doable. Rock Tomb. 
You fucking troll. So we have to sucker punch the haunter. You little rat. Now it's just gonna fucking destiny bond us. That's probably alright though, we'll just go to this thing and save the haunter. Save the thingy. Alright, banded knockoff. I think it's a close one, it's just going to be like a Houndoom matchup to finish it. Am I bugging you? Yes. Go to this. He's already terrored. Don't need to worry about that. So we just go for a, have a nice little side shock. Get some chip off. That's definitely Fizz Death, right? So it's a case of does slacking actually take that out? Maybe. I mean, we got to try, right? Because if I go to this thing, he just goes to his own Hound Doom, which wars it. So we're just going to go for the Banded Double Edge and see what happens. You know, slacking it, it might be a piece of shit, but it is a fun Pokemon to use. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> imagine if we got Kofagrigus back so you could change his ability. And imagine if Pursuit was still a thing so you could, you know, reliably trap something. It's a shame Pursuit's gone, but knockoff is is something, right? And we do absolutely destroy that thing, which is amazing. I don't think we win this. You know, I'm starting at half. <laughs> we just have to win speed ties and get flinches, essentially, is what's going on here. Kind of nice though, decent damage. He's gonna try fire blast us, which is you know, we flash fire, get you baited. Oh no! So it literally comes down to a speed tie. Hey, we did it! Good work. Good work, Houndoom. Ah, another beautiful day for double edge slacking. Look at this. Apart from this thing, obviously. But we're alright. We got some good stuff. I'll go with. I can go with the Toe Score lead. No, that's dumb. Let's not do that. I'm a little bit worried about the Houndoom, that's what I'm thinking. So maybe Raichu. Because Medicham. Okay. So, in case he's fake out, we're going to do this. Mark, okay. I don't mind that, we're just going to go for the Poltergeist here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Same again. I don't know, most people would go to Houndoom on the, the Wisp, but maybe you just knew it was an offensive set. So there's his own spirit team. We can see his lefties, that's good to know. I mean, I could trick it. Yeah, fuck it. Let's take those lefties. Because apparently spirit team gets toxic, this is news to me. <laughs> I will... I'll go with one. Don't also have will o -Wisp, please. That'd be ridiculous. Spike it up. So this thing could be my saviour against, like, Medicham and... 
Well, pilot swine for sure. But I definitely want to get the spikes up and then spin block where possible. Because it's quite a fat team. Alright, Medicham's in. What we got for us, friend? Since they're normally choice, we may as well try and scout. Poison jab, huh? Okay, I'm not... Poison jab on the spirit team? Alright. Might as well go for spike number three as he gets up his rocks. And we'll body press. Right, we don't mind that. <laughs> In comes the big boy. Let's go for the double edge. Good play going spirit team. That's alright, he's taking some hazards. It's definitely looking like Orthorn Wars, this. Yeah, okay. I don't mind that. Just gonna go for a nice little heavy slam. Now, we can definitely prevent some spins. So, I'm liking the, the setup we got going on here. Had a champ. Yeah, I'm fairly sure it's going to be choice, so let's just scout. Okay, yes. So we can either go to the the obvious spirit tomb. Or... Eh. I mean, we could. Yeah, fuck it. Gonna go to the Hound Doom. I am curious to see what. He's not boots, which is unusual, so maybe Life Orb. Don't know. I'm clicking Poltergeist. <laughs> he does that, that's fine. I actually don't have a Terra Ghost now that I look at it. Maybe I'll go for a nasty plot here. Lodge bomb, okay. And unfortunately, wins the speed tyler. Very, very unfortunate. Alright, let's go to this thing. I too have a sludge bomb. And I'm clicking it in case you tear on me. <laughs> Let's get rid of that, that's nice. Obviously we can take out the muck. Quaxwell is probably in terror, if I had to guess. Just to get rid of those hazards. Medicham we're fine against, as long as we keep our Raichu. Goodbye, Orthworm. It's been lit. As he does Zen, thankfully, that's... That's a good save. Just thinking if we... Yeah, we might as well go straight to this thing. Let's go Spirit Tomb. Now, could he have Sneak on this? Yes, but... I'm not actually that concerned. I'm going to vault out. Bring an Orthworm because it kind of wars this, apart from Pain Split.
I think we just heavy slam. It's not worth doubling to risk Raichu, to be honest. Well, this is going to take a long fucking time, isn't it? <laughs> Heavy slam! Come on, little Orthworm, let's go. You're nearly there. Just a little crumb more damage. And you get rid of this thing. Oh, he does have sneak, okay. Right, so that's something. Goes to this dumbass duck. Which is kind of... It's a little bit scary. Go straight to Toad Scroll, I think. Yep, don't mind that. Slurp time. Ah, yes. And there's a spin which we don't really care about at this point. I could actually go for the Lenny cleanup. Oh, maybe not because he's a salt vest. Forget I said anything. He's going to take this one. Alright, man. We go to this, we we spike. I forgot I had rapid spin. <laughs> uh oh. Bring the chocolate mouse. I, I keep fucking thinking he's terror, but he hasn't. Should vault switch. Goes into a dark type. Yep. Yeah. Now what? Oh, it doesn't matter, I'll just double edge. He doesn't have setup by the looks of it, so I think we're fine. That's scuff. So all we gotta do is click base the any move here. So just side shock, I guess. But I am faster. Is the ability? Yes. <laughs> sure, we'll go with that. Search Surfer makes you faster than Medicham always, without question. But there's no terrain. Yeah, man. Just, this is a different kind of Raichu. Built diff. GG. Silver Pegasus. What in God's name? Is Tauros is here? <laughs> I knew Diplin was down there, but the Tauros kind of surprises me. Yeah, that is that is crazy. Okay. Obviously, fighting types are not good for us aside from Spirit Tomb, so we've got to keep that around. Uh, I'll probably try and go with Raichu. No. Slacking lead. Fuck it. Let's go. I'll just go straight for the Bandit Quake, because he turns into a ghost type, interestingly. Huh. Okay. In that case, we'll do this. Should get some good damage on Houndoom still. That's amazing damage. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's good on my own. 
Slurp that up, thank you. And the pulse. <laughs> I want the Pyrotor's name, you should have noticed. Hey man. Okay, Silver Pegasus, I, I don't know your gender. Hey friend. Oh, definitely the Sneasel was looking menacing. Does Taurus get anything that for Spiritomb? I mean, it doesn't really matter what it clicks, because Houndoom will die anyway. I could go to Orthworm and just hope he doesn't click the fighting move. But that sounds like a bad idea. So let's just do this. Okay. Fine. So we can just click this again. This goes to Dipples, which will take a good chunk. Eh, it's not bad. Could be worse. We're going to go to... Big Lenny. Takes a chunk. Drop a sludge. Would the Rhydon actually beat this? What would it have? That does a pretty good chunk. So he just roars us out. <laughs> it's that time again. Banded Poltergeist. So we get rid of the Terramon, which is amazing. I don't know if Slacking has to do anything in this game. I guess I'll split by... I, I, mean, I think Speed Tie with Tauros, but... Definitely Sneasel's quicker. Bruh. What do we do? I'll try Orthworm. Goes for the edge. Definitely a, a real chance of the the bulk up here, but I'm going to risk it. Just go for a spike. Right, this thing needs to be chipped. It's beautiful. Do we Terra? Yes. Yeah, that still puts us in a good spot. Alright, Dipples is in. Obviously we're going to get recovered on. So maybe it's best just to... I want to go hard slacking, but we wouldn't be able to kill it from full. Let me just spike again. Okay, there's a deep pulse, that's fine. Don't mind that. Okay, I think we go hand him. Just dark pulse. Now, we're just going to get a chance to spin here, but I think that's okay. No, terrible loss, fair enough. Here comes the big Taurus. Yep. And what do we do? Fuck it, we sack this thing as the earthquakes. I think, at this point, Big Lenny's got it. May as well spin, just to ensure that we outspeed that thing. Alright, slurp him up. Oh, he's Scarf. 
Okay, Lockwood can take that. Drain again, and he's gone. GG, friend. Okay, last one. Puissance to fur. Power of fire, if my French is right. And he does have a Houndoom, which is a little bit scary. How about we go with the, the big slack? There's Spide Ops. Fuck you, Spide Ops. <laughs> Maybe knock off in case he goes to Sableye. He should expect the double edge. Stays in, unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. Alright, man. I can get my shit up too, that's fine. I do have boots on a couple of mons, it's not a massive deal. Let's just get all these up. Alright, looks good. So now we fire blast just in case. It's Houndoom. That's irrelevant because he can't hit me with fire moves anyway. And we'll just Dark Pulse, see what happens. Life Orb? No, Specs. That's a Specs hit. Okay, one more of these and then a Sucker Punch, I think. No, never mind. Another Dark Pulse. So that's a big pick. Goes to Flippy. I think... I mean, I would love to prevent a spin. Let's try that. There's the Aura Wheel. It's Life Orb, so we can go for a little bit of Sneak Chip. Yeah, that's decent. So we'll go to this. If he wants to spin, then I'm doing the same thing. Fine by me. Right, in comes Madame Webb. Mm, there's no chance we actually kill him here. I'm just wondering if we use this just to sweep from here. Could he stop it? Like, especially if we get a poison on the Sableye, you know? Nope, not quite. Cause that's decent damage. Light screen, you little rat. Alright, so we got our poison. I don't want to get clothed. So we gotta be a little bit careful. Maybe Houndoom? Question mark. Plot up here. Obviously the plan is some kind of set up here, but I don't think that's an issue. I think Orthworm would be able to take it on anyway. So I'll just do this. Okay. Well, that's alright. We don't mind that. Go straight to scroll And slurp. Yep, 
Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The poison is a, a massive help taking this thing down. Okay, there's Raichu. So first we spin to ensure that we're fine with our own Raichu. Then we bop this thing with an Earth Power. Alluring voice. Good effort. But Big Lenny's got this. No problem. <laughs> okay, yes, yeah, fine. Now we go to this. We vault. No, ooh, I almost did it. I almost fucked up. <laughs> I know you guys were screaming, do not fucking click vault switch. We Psy Shock. Yeah, I really want to see if Slacking can just double edge this thing. I guess Spider Ops, okay. Double edge. Little rat. Oh, he's Regenerator, I didn't even realise that. I guess he didn't take Anger Shell earlier, so yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Well, I am curious to see if he can beat the slacking. Just get some of his rocks, okay. I thought with light screen it would be some sort of anger shell shit. No, that's properly defensive. Alright, listen here, you little shit. What's that gonna ride you? And of course, of course you know what time it is. Beautiful. Let's grab one more. Alright, last one. We've got a nice, strong looking Sun team here. So Scooby Doom is going to be the key player. I'm just going to one shot something turn one, to be honest. Goodbye, Volpix. Or whatever comes in. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. <laughs> Is it going to give him a chance to set up and win? Probably. But I think we have to do it to him. Hey, that's a good pick. I'll take the Charizard. Unfortunately, we have to deal with these pesky grass types. Alright, there's Egg. I mean, I, I'm sure he's going to have, like, Terrifier, Terrorblast in there somewhere, but I feel like i got to try this. Like, I'm not going to go hard hound doom this. That seems like a really bad idea. Yeah, okay. So Raichu is still quicker. I think that's reasonable. Maybe we keep Toad Scroll because it can tear into a poison type. Like a Terra Blast there, which is amazing. I'm not confident we take a Solar Beam. So I think I'm just going to sucker for Chip. Yeah, okay. So that's basically what we expected. So now we go back to this thing. Nice little Volt Switch, pick him off. Hmm. Then we go back to slacking. I think a Life Orb Victory Bell Solar Beam would kill us. Anything else would probably not. So let's see. Let's see if he does it. Power Whip would not kill us. There's no way. So we get a nice little pick there. 
Hmm. Don't tell me your swords don't shiftry. Surely not. Go spirit team. That's a little bit better that he's not set up. Okay, let's just foul play just in case. Because then we go back to slacking. And you already know what we click. You already know, folks. <laughs> Gone. Alright, there's the tree. Goodbye, Lenny. Oh, he does have growth, unfortunate. Because we get absolutely fucked. Well, I hope we're faster. Good. <laughs> Obviously, he's plus attack nature, which is amazing for us. Just gonna terror blast here. It's looking like we can get the the optimal finish here, folks. The double edge. I'm guessing this is just sunny day healing wish or some shit, which works for me. Kill me. Kill me. Full power. Oh well. It was a good result for slacking anyway. <laughs> Hope you enjoy this one. We need more people to play this tier. There's no players. Alright? It's a very fun tier. Thanks for watching, folks. I will see you all soon.